In today's video, we'll be looking at the Africa Cup of Nations. But not the one currently taking place in Ivory Coast. If you would like to see videos about this, then I can recommend the playlist for the match predictions. I'll link it for you in the top right hand corner. If you want to help me and my channel, please leave a like and a comment now. That would help me and satisfy the YouTube algorithm. Thanks. Today we're looking at the African nations that have never qualified for the Africa Cup of Nations. These are nine nations that I will now introduce to you. Central African Republic Lesotho Iswatini Djibouti Somalia Seychelles South Sudan Chad and Sao Tome and Principe. These nine nations will be divided into three groups to determine the winner in this special edition of the Africa Cup of Nations. The best team in each group will progress to the semi-finals, as will the best second place team. This means that five nations will be eliminated after the group stage. Let's go straight to the group stage and take a look at the results. Group A consists of the Central African Republic, Lesotho and Iswatini. This tournament is still too strong for Iswatini. Two defeats and no goals scored in the group stage meant they were eliminated in the preliminary round. Lesotho can win the direct duel with Iswatini and thus secure second place. They must now hope that they will be the best runners up from all groups. The Central African Republic cruised through the group without any problems, scoring a whopping seven goals in two games. They have already shown in the group stage that they are a force to be reckoned with in this tournament. Group B continues with South Sudan, Chad and Sao Tome and Principe. Sao Tome has no chance and is eliminated with two defeats. At least in the game against Chad they were able to hold their own and almost draw. Chad are in second place in the table and must hope that they can still make it to the semi-finals as the best runners up in the group. South Sudan, on the other hand, can easily hold their own in this group and can therefore be regarded as another favourite in this tournament. The last group consists of Djibouti, Somalia and the Seychelles. Here, too, there is a clear worst performer. The Seychelles lost both games by a clear margin and finished bottom of the table with no goals and a staggering 11 goals conceded in just two games. In second place is Djibouti, who are inferior to Somalia due to having scored one goal less. Djibouti must therefore help to go the way of the runners-up. Let's take a look at the table of the runners-up. Chad and Lesotho have achieved the same final result. Unfortunately, it was not enough for either of them, as Djibouti scored four points to finish as the best runners-up and complete the semi-finals. In the semi-finals, the Central African Republic will face the runner-up Djibouti and South Sudan will meet Somalia. And what a game that must have been. A whopping seven goals were scored in the first semi-final and it couldn't have been any closer. In the end, the Central African Republic managed to beat Djibouti 4-3 after 90 minutes, creating a memorable match. In the other semi-final, there was a small surprise. South Sudan were very convincing in the group phase, but now had to concede a 2-1 defeat and let Somalia go through to the final. But now let's take a look at the loser game. The match for third place, where Djibouti and South Sudan meet. South Sudan also lost this match 2-1 and had to concede victory to Djibouti. Congratulations to Djibouti for winning third place. But now on to the really important game. The Central African Republic and Somalia will face each other in the final. The Central African Republic has won every game so far, impressing in offense but showing some weaknesses in defense. Somalia, on the other hand, have mostly played very seriously and have been able to win their games narrowly but confidently thanks to strong control. The Central African Republic is doing what it does best. 
poor at the back and top at the front. The final ends in a legendary battle after 90 minutes with a score of 3-2. That will have been another legendary game. Congratulations to the Central African Republic on winning the Africa Cup of Nations. If you liked the video, please leave a like and a comment, that would help me and my channel a lot. Thanks.